Hi, my name is Hayden and I'm going to show you guys a way to make a quick D score slash hook. Okay, just so you guys know, this is going to be a pretty quick tutorial, but I'm actually going to post a longer step by step tutorial on my YouTube channel. So be sure to look for that if you want to know more. Okay, so the first step in order to making a hook is first of all, well, you have your piston and you have to attach that to the side of your robot. And it can be like a little diagonal, but the most important thing is that it's just attached to the side of your mo robot and just make sure it's able to move because it has to like be able to move like slightly, but that's the most important thing. Okay, your next step to making this hook is to get your little C channel and attach it to the robot. You wanna attach it like loosely, like with zip ties or rubber bands so that it has the freedom to move, but it's not like stuck on the robot because it needs to be able to go up and down so it can like do the movement and like knock off the balls. The third and final step in order to building this hook is to connect the C channel with the pneumatics piston. And once it's, con once it's connected, you'll be able to like move it up and down with the pneumatics piston. So hopefully then your hook will be done. But of course it is not the simple, you have to do a bunch of other things, but I will go in like, sp like specifics in my long video on my YouTube channel. But this is just a quick little short just to like get you guys kind of understanding how to do it. And just so you guys know, I'm not sure if this is like a great way to do your hook, but this is how I did mine and I thought it was really easy and simple. So I wanted to share this with you guys. And this isn't the most efficient or effective way. I'm just sharing my opinion and how I did mine just so you guys can get inspired by me. Thank you for watching. Bye.